Hygiene is a very important part of life. However, not everyone has access to the luxury of hygiene products. A survey done by Honolulu Star Advertiser in January of 2019 counted 4,311 homeless people on the island of Oahu. The majority of these people don't have the money to buy hygiene products. But at Aliomano Middle, two classes are working together to do their part to address this issue. The 7th grade leadership students, together with the 8th grade AVID students, organized the hygiene drives in hopes to help the homeless by allowing students to donate hygiene products such as deodorant and laundry detergent. If you go downtown, you could see tons of homeless people on the street, so hopefully you want to help them out by giving them luxuries that we take for granted every day that maybe they don't have. The idea was separately conceptualized by students from both classes. In order to make sure supplies got to those in need, the students ended up partnering with Family Promise, an organization with a mission to help homeless and low-income families achieve sustainable independence with the help of community. Yeah, so Family Promise of Hawaii is a nonprofit organization that deals with uh, multiple aspects of just helping families out in need. So one of the needs was uh, their month was collecting hygiene products. So that actually kind of fell into line of what we were trying to do, um, both the eighth grade AVID class and the seventh grade leadership class. The two classes partnership was born from a coincidence, as both classes just happened to come up with the same idea for a service project. Miss Young actually contacted me and let me know that her leadership class was doing the same thing so that um, both groups of students should work together. So that's kind of where the partnership started. So they worked on the flyers together, they worked on the infomercials for it. There was still doubt about whether there would be any donations at all. Uh, when it started, a lot of uh, we had like a lot of doubt because we weren't sure if we could top the can stacking competition, and we wanted to hopefully get donations. And then when we finished, we did get donations, which was really exciting because we didn't go in thinking that we were going to get anything. They found that most things that were donated were free products from hotels, as opposed to things you might find around your home. The drive was still a great success for the leadership class and helped students to make a change in their communities while learning to be a leader. When we did our service project, um, it definitely had a change on my perspective of seeing things in different ways. It gave me some time to actually see things head on and give me some actual situations where I can use those leadership skills, so some actual life lessons. I think what was nice about it is that the kids really got to work on um, and figure out solutions to problems of things that are in our community. So in the end, it seems that everyone involved benefited from the experience in making a difference in their community. This is Kami Martinez from Alumanu Middle School for Hiki No. Hiki No, Thursday at 7.30 on PBS Hawaii.